Okay, so uh, I'm Ryan from Noodle Cake, and I'm here showing off a game called Chameleon Run. So Chameleon Run is a auto runner um, that is a level based, not endless. Um, that has a pretty unique spin to it. Um, it's all about color switching. So I'm just gonna jump right into the tutorial here, just to kind of show you how it works. So as you can see, you got your little guy running here, and it's telling you. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> but I got to jump. Step tap, one. <laughs> yeah, tap the screen to jump over the black. So you want to keep the yellow on the yellow. It's pretty pretty simple so far. So I'm just tapping the right side. Um, so now things are slowing down because the color's changing. So what I want you to do is tap the left side of the screen, and I'll switch color. So ah. now it's pink, pink on pink. So if I was to switch to the yellow right now, obviously I would crash. You'd so, be booted. Yeah. So I'm All just about gonna, color matching. Yeah. So I'm gonna switch again. And this was made by a guy who was colorblind. So no works way. works for colorblind players as well. Seriously. Yeah. We found that out after the fact. <laughs> That's really, amazing. Yeah, the game all about color from a guy who's colorblind. a guy who's colorblind. Yeah. I love that. Yeah, amazing. So, okay, so that's the tutorial. Pretty simple stuff. So, I'm going to show you now each level has a structure that is set up based on different achievements. So, right now you're going to see some different things floating in the world. I'm just going to grab these smoking crystals here. So, what do these smoking crystals do? Well, each achievement um, for each level is tied to uh, various objects. So, I'll show you here once I complete this level that there's going to be a row of achievements across the bottom. So there you can see that I've collected oh. the smoking crystal achievement. There's a marble achievement, and then a locked one that says don't switch colors. So before I advance to the next level, I'm just gonna replay this one, uh -huh. and I'm gonna go through and grab the marbles. And now you can see what happened there, there was a little lightning bolt. And every time I complete one of those achievements, you get a lightning bolt. And the lightning bolt allows you to complete the level a little bit faster. So the goal is as you complete each of these objectives, you can now complete the level a little bit faster, a little bit faster each time. So basically, you've got to go back and complete these objectives, otherwise you're never going to unlock the higher score. And you've got to keep on playing the same level a few times. Exactly. If you're, if you're one of those high score chasers who are looking for, you know, you can play this game and go through and just beat each level and be done with it, which is fine. Yeah. But if you're one of those people that really wants to chase the high score, your goal is you're going to want to unlock all these things. So now we'll see that I've opened up the don't switch color. So I'm going to run through this one more time. Oop. Went to the wrong one there. I'm just going to switch back. And I'm not going to switch colors. We're going to get that perfect score. Yeah, we're going to go for it. Go on. And so this is a pretty simple level, obviously, to start. And we'll show you yeah. as we go on here something a little bit more advanced. It's a little bit more frantic. <clears throat> and there's another speed boost there. So nice. now my time is increased. And I've got the last one. So now I've got three colors, or three opened up. And in addition to the lightning bolts, there's now a little surfboard that will appear that really allows me to go faster. And there's a little hint where if I switch colors, as you can see here, right before I land, I'll get an additional speed boost. So there's even oh. some extra skill involved for the really hardcore players. Clever. So this is a game that you, you can really decide your own difficulty and exactly. how well so, you do. Check that out. That's so, so we're, speedy. We're ripping here. Boom. So complete. Oh, only two stars. I didn't do as well. Oh, so no. you want to go under 10 seconds to get the fastest time. So the whole idea is a whole point two nine seven yeah, seconds. Just out. Could, couldn't do it. <laughs> but you know, players will be able to play over and over again and really time their jumps and be able to get you know quite a bit further. So I'm just going to jump to. Um, sorry, here I'll just jump back into it and go to an unlock level and just kind of show you how things advance because cool. the game can get quite hectic. Nice. So this this is when it gets super tricky. Yeah. Yeah. So you can see it's, it's moving platforms. Whoa. Oh jeez, I didn't oh my make goodness. myself. But the nice thing is it just puts you right back into it, so you don't even really have time to think, and you can just get right back into the game. So it's something that you guys watching right now can't see, but literally I mean, your thumbs are going mental yeah. on the screen. <laughs> Like left yeah, I don't even right. really, it's, it's kind of muscle memory. I don't even know what I'm doing sometimes. I black out in the levels. <laughs> so, so yeah, that's Chameleon Run. There's, uh, uh, whoops, I'm back to the level again. There's a bunch of different levels to play through. Um, I'll just drop out here. Um, so right now there's there's 16 levels. We're going to be adding more cool. um, after the game has been launched. So each level, like I said, has about four or three main objectives to play through yep. other than the completion. So there's four different ways you can complete, you know, complete the level, get all three objectives, and then do the high score. So nice. even though 
you know, there isn't a ton of levels to start. You can actually, the replayability is very high in this yeah. game, so you can just kind of keep going Go through. over and over. Exactly, and then those all those high score chasers will be trying to one-up each other for level after level. So, so. are you going to launch this on iOS and Android? Yes. Yeah. Awesome, yeah. and it's gonna, is it a premium game or is it free? Uh, this will be a premium game. Yeah. Cool, do yeah. we have a rough price point yet? Uh, we're probably going to be launching around the 199 mark, I think, around there, so it won't go too high um, to start, but I think that's that's kind of the sweet spot. Nice one. Doing, so. so when can we get our hands on it? Um, probably within the next month or so. Month awesome. and a half. So we have, stay tuned for, you know, we're going to be launching some trailers and things in the next few weeks. So we'll have some dates solidified. So.